I'm David Toman, author of NootropicsExpert.com, and in this video I'm going to share with you what I know about choline citrate. What it is, why we use it, the science behind it, dosage, and possible side effects. Choline citrate is choline combined with citrate, an ester of citric acid. Citrate in choline helps with the synthesis of acetylcholine. The combination of these ingredients increases the effectiveness of this source above, um, of choline above simply providing another source of choline to your brain. Choline was declared an essential nutrient by the Food and Nutrition Board of the National Institute of Medicine in 1998. Choline is considered an essential nutrient because when your body uses it faster than it can produce it, you need supplemental choline either from food or a supplement. Choline is found in foods such as uh, beef, beef steak, liver, chicken liver, eggs, cod, broccoli, peanut butter, and milk. Now you need choline for the production of the neurotransmitter acetylcholine and to form phosphatidylcholine, or PC, a key ingredient in the membranes of each brain cell. In fact, choline is so vital to cognition and nerve function that without it, we couldn't move, we couldn't think, sleep, or remember anything. Numerous human and animal studies have shown enhanced brain function when given supplemental choline. Now, citric, citrate is a citric acid ester which provides a third of the acetyl groups used in um, the acetylcholine synthesis process. You can get citric acid from fruits like lemon and limes. And citrate plays another important role in the brain. Citrate is an intermediate of the Krebs, Krebs cycle, which is also known as the TCA cycle, or the citric acid cycle. Citrate synthase catalyzes the conversion of oxaloacetate with acetyl-CoA to form citrate. Citrate then acts as a substrate for aconitase and is converted to uh, aconic, ac aconitic acid. This cycle ends with the regeneration of oxaloacetate. This series of chemical reactions is the source of two-thirds of the energy we get from food. Now, most of the energy made available by these steps is transferred in the form of NADH, which then drives adenosine triphosphate, or ATP synthesis, that fuels mitochondria and provides the energy needed for brain cells. Now let's take a look at a minute for a minute at all the different types of um, choline supplements that we've got available to use as uh, nootropic supplements to help us understand the difference between them. So we're going to compare choline citrate with choline bitrotrate with CDP choline uh, with uh, alpha GPC. Well, first of all, choline is a water-soluble nutrient, and its composition is similar to the B vitamins. Choline citrate, CDP choline, choline bitrotrate, and alpha-GPC are all sources of choline. Choline citrate. This is an economical form of choline combined with citrate and about 50% choline by weight. So one gram of uh, choline citrate offers 500 milligrams of actual choline. Choline citrate not only provides your brain with choline, but it comes with one of the acetyl groups necessary for acetylcholine synthesis. Now, choline bitrotrate is an economical form of choline, too, and about 40% choline by weight. So one gram of choline bitrotrate offers 400 milligrams of actual choline. It doesn't cross the blood-brain barrier as readily as other sources of choline, so you won't experience the same level of nootropic benefits as you would with alpha GPC or CDP choline. Now CDP choline is only about 18% choline by weight. Your body naturally synthesizes choline into CDP choline. It's then converted into phosphatidylcholine or PC, which is one of two fatty acids that make up the outer layer of cell membranes. NPC provides the choline ne needed to synthesize acetylcholine. And finally, alpha-GPC. It's about 40% choline by weight, and it easily crosses the blood-brain barrier. 
Alpha GPC naturally occurs in your brain as a byproduct of phosphatidylcholine or PC. When your brain needs more choline and choline float, the choline floating around in your brain is running low, it breaks down PC from cell membranes and turns it into alpha GPC. So your body and brain loves it when you use choline because it doesn't have to cannibalize its own cells to get more choline. So how does choline citrate actually work in your brain? Well, two ways in particular stand out. First, it boosts acetylcholine. Now, acetylcholine is a neurotransmitter that's tied to memory and overall brain function. Choline citrate is a precursor to acetylcholine, improving the efficiency of communications between neurons in your brain. This increase in neural signaling will boost memory, learning, cognitive processing, and mental clarity. But research has found that circulating choline in the brain decreases with age. This study recruited younger adults between 20 and 40 years and older adults between 60 and 85 years. After fasting overnight, the subject received 50 milligrams of a choline supplement per kilogram of body weight. The labs were drawn to determine the choline concentration in the blood. And proton magnetic resonance spectroscopy was performed to determine the relative concentration of the systolic choline containing compounds in the brain. Both tests were done before and several hours after choline supplementation. Levels of choline in the blood and brain of the study subjects were similar before um, choline supplementation. But after choline supplementation, the younger subjects showed a 60% increase in choline in their, in their body and their brain. The older subjects only showed a 16% increase uh, in choline levels. The researchers concluded that circulating choline in the brain decreases with age. And given the key role of choline in brain function, this change may be a contributing factor in the onset of late life neurodegeneration and dementia. So according to this study, older adults should be supplementing with higher doses of a choline supplement like choline citrate just to maintain cognitive function compared to younger adults. And the second way uh, is a choline citrate boosts memory. Researchers and medical professionals have long known about poor memory in people with choline deficiency. A study at Northwestern University in Chicago tested people with a choline deficiency. They gave them a series of memory tests and found their scores below average. Now in this study, they then gave uh, one group extra choline and the others were given a placebo. After 24 weeks, both groups repeated the memory tests. The groups who received the extra choline showed a dramatic improvement in memory. The placebo group performed poorly as expected with scores uh, the same as from the original test. Research from hundreds of studies have shown that choline will eliminate brain fog and confusion, boost energy, improve learning, enhance memory and recall, help focus and reduce irritability, improve physical performance, and eliminate fatigue. Choline citrate is water soluble and after it's digested, it'll enter your bloodstream and cross into the blood brain barrier. Once in your brain, it boosts neural signal transmission and helps repair neurons. Choline citrate improves your brain function and memory by increasing the production of acetylcholine and prevents neurons from getting cannibalized when your brain is searching for more choline. So how does choline citrate feel when you use it as a supplement? Well, after taking it, you should feel a boost in your ability to think, your mood should improve, and your energy levels should go up. Choline citrate influences the level of acetylcholine in your brain. This critical neurotransmitter affects memory, cognition, recall, and learning. Low levels of choline will leave you with uh, brain fog and an inability to think clearly. You may also experience a drop in mood and some irritability. And if you're using anything from the racetam family of nootropics, 
and you experience a headache, your brain is likely starved for choline. Now, we've got links to plenty of studies. Go to Nootropics Expert and search for uh, choline citrate and uh, take a look at the studies that talk about uh, choline, how it boosts cognition in huge groups of people. And choline citrate helping with exercise and muscle performance. It's all there on Nootropics Expert. It's for dosage. Recommended choline citrate dosage is 500 milligrams to 3,000 milligrams a day. And you can use higher doses of choline citrate because this is a water-soluble version of choline. And a limited amount of this choline source will cross the blood-brain barrier. Studies have found that age has a significant effect on choline uptake in the brain. So older people are encouraged to use larger doses of choline citrate compared to younger neurohackers. Other fat-soluble versions of choline, such as alpha-GPC and CDP-choline, more readily cross into the blood, across the blood-brain barrier, and they make it make their way into your cells. So lower doses are required. As for side effects, recommended dosages, even for extended periods, are considered well tolerated and safe. Now, while choline citrate is considered non-toxic. It is possible to experience toxicity with too much choline in your body. So, if you experience trouble sleeping or a headache, diarrhea, lower high blood pressure, nausea, blurred vision, or chest pain, you should st stop using uh, choline citrate or lower your dose. As for available forms, choline citrate is sold in capsule and powder form. Capsules are usually 500 to 650 milligrams each. Some ready-made nootropic stacks and even some brand name vitamins contain choline citrate in their formula. So check the label. So my nootropics expert recommendation, I recommend choline citrate 500 to 3000 milligrams per day. And that's my report on choline citrate. If you want to uh, see links to the studies I talked about, go to nootropicsexpert.com and search for choline citrate or click on the link below this video. There you'll find a full transcript of this video and you'll find dozens of articles on all the well-known nootropics on Nootropics Expert. If you have any questions or you want to share your experience using choline citrate, go to my article at nootropicsexpert.com and leave it in the comments section at the bottom of the article. If you want to see more videos on all the popular nootropics used today, subscribe to this channel before you leave. I'll be putting out new videos on nootropics and optimizing your brain every week. I'm David Toming, author of Nootropics Expert.